Hello guys and welcome back to Wheel of Misfortune or should I be saying welcome to Wheel of Misfortune. Yes, you will notice our surroundings are very 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 much different. Now, it turns out when I recorded the first two episodes I actually made a bit of a map mishap. I know, Misfortune map mishap. Woo! Basically there was a newer version of the game than the one I was playing. So I was currently playing 5.0 and this now is 6.0 and before you all say Yoshi 7.0 is now out I know it Jesus seriously I know it is but that is a Christmas themed map and from what I can tell uh, I was gonna say 5.0 that was the mistake I made the first time 6.0 actually has a lot more content and it's longer lasting so that is what I am gonna be aiming for as a series um, so I guess count episode one and two as the basics. Um, I kind of told you what the map is, so I'm not going to repeat myself this episode. I'm just going to jump straight into it. Um, and yeah, I, I, I guess that's it. I, I'm sorry for that. Thank you to the people in the comments who informed me of that. Otherwise, I actually wouldn't have known. But, uh, you know, let's not dwell on that. Let's move on. Let's have a good time and let's play Wheel of Fortune. Wheel of Misfortune, <laughs> even 6.0. Okay, let's open this chest. What have we got? Uh, okay, I am on survival. I had to reinstall too many items the other day, so that confused me for a second. Okay, um, I think that's the same we had last time, wasn't it? Maybe the items are a little different, I don't know. Let me uh, sort out my inventory. Awesome. I, I'm going to put my stone hoe up there, because, you know, I, I rarely need stone hoes. Stone hoes are the worst kind of hoe. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Also, I have just realised that the list of goals is not available to my eyes right now. I'm blinking and it is saying not available, so I will be right back. I need to go and fetch that. Fail. I've got it. Right, so uh, I think that, uh, yeah, we last, well, that was a clusterfuck. Last time, the one we were really going for was craft a bed, wasn't it? Not just because, you know, it's a very easy goal, but because it's kind of vital to the game. I mean, it's nice to have a place where I know that if I die, I will spawn back there. And then within that, I can, uh, I can store some of my items. Ooh, an apple. I forgot about getting apples from trees. I know, it's like, obvious. How did I forget that? So that is what we're going to try and do today. Again, I need to try and find some sheep. And apparently sheep are kind of scarce on this map. I can't see anywhere on any of the rings this time. At least last time I was like, fine, there's none here, but I know where there is one. I can't see any right now. So joy to the world, Hugh has failed. <laughs> that needs to be a Christmas song. We need to make that right now. Also, I'm taking down a bunch of these trees to get some basics. Okay, oh god, they're all dropping over the edge! I have a thing with that, don't I? I love dropping things over the edge, apparently, which is not a good trait of mine, I will admit. Okay, let me cut this out. Um, I have no idea how deep this goes. This is actually going to be interesting. Let me let me try and find this out, because I have just had a brainwave. I could make a little house here. No, I couldn't. It is not long enough. Although, you know what? I will try anyway. I, I think I've got enough dirt to do a basic. If I fall right now, slippy pinky, don't fail me. If you're wondering, what the hell is Slippy Pinky? Go watch Sky Survival, I'm not explaining it again. My mind is not in the right position. My mind is not far, like, far enough in the gutter to explain Slippy Pinky just yet. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I, I could make like a, like a little house kind of thing off the side of the wheel. There's no rule against breaking the wheel. I don't see why we don't do that. Like a very basic house, yeah, but still, it's a house, you know. And we need a house right now. We need some foundations. Not the foundations you put on your face, crazy people. The foundation. Oh, I see a chicken. I thought that was a sheep then. I got all excited. I'm getting so excited over one sheep. The things these maps make you feel, seriously. Sheep, where are you? Ah, I see one up there. You're on the wrong side, good sir. You need to be here. Like this chicken, see? He may not be the right species, but he's got the right idea. Come on. Come on. There's a random gravel block there. Awesome. There's some diamond on both sides. Very, uh... Iron and diamond on each side, rather. Very nice. From what I can tell, by the way, in 6.0, there are more. In fact, there are many more rings than just this. I've seen stuff with, like, a nether uh, ring portal, and then you go into that nether portal, and then you can come out another side, and there's even more. Obviously, that's going to be explored a lot later on in the game, but I just thought I'd bring that up to you. That was the main reason why I didn't just switch with, uh, didn't just stick even with uh, 5.0 because from what I can tell 6.0 has so much content and I'm all about I am all about the content bringing to you guys you know that's my main priority content to you guys enjoyment happiness and smiles and that is how 
a Yoshi infomercial would go. What would what would an infomercial I'd do be? What would that even be? What would the info part be? I'd be fine doing the Marshall. <laughs> that does that's not even a word, but I would be fine doing the Marshall, like the like the editing and the presentation. But what would the actual information be? I have no idea. If anyone wants to say an infomercial I could do, I know that's a really, really, really random thing. But uh, if anyone wants to, I'm looking for a sheep. There are no sheep here, are there? No, I don't think so. Oh boy, this is going to be an interesting night without a bed. I'm going to have to do episode one all over again. That was awful. I was going to say hell, but then I said awe, and it was a mixture of the two. That was awful. That was awful. Um, <laughs> I'm mixing words today, but they're, the, they're cocktails of words. You know, I, I shove them in my jar. I turn them around a bit. I do some fancy tricks, and next thing you know, I've got a word that no one ever heard of before. Where the hell is my dirt? Oh, I was chopping up leaves, wasn't I? Well, uh, that's a good start. <laughs> okay, let me place a chest down. Let me make a crafting bench as well. Let's get the basics of a home down. Let's do a lot more than we did last time. I mean, we won't be able to sleep, and that's similar, but, you know, we've got the very big foundations of a house down right now, and I'm happy with that. To start off, this is a much nicer start than episode one. You know, making progress, learning lessons, and kicking ass. I don't know what kicking ass has got to do with anything about it. But, you know, if, if you ever want to sound epic, just say you kick ass and that's pretty much it. Hey, what did you do today? Kicked ass. Oh my god, he's so cool. Or at least that's in how my mind, in, that's how in my mind it works, but it doesn't work like that. Sad face. You know, I, I would love to <laughs> just do that. Okay, uh, this is a very, very, very bare bones house. But come on, guys, did you really expect anything else? Uh, actually, let me put it. Actually, no, let's have both. And we will, in fact, guys, on episode one, we will, in fact, craft a door. Oh, yeah, check this out. We're going hardcore style. Open hardcore style! Up, 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 hardcore style. Okay, let me uh, store in the more valuable stuff in now, because we can't recollect that, guys. It's very important. Let me take one piece of steak there so we don't lose any. And I will actually keep the rest of this. And I'll save some torches there, just in case. Okay, so on a... Uh, on a beginning point, we're not in a bad position. You know, we, we've got a house. We have somewhere nice to stay the night. And we have storage options. We just don't have any beds, which is bad. Also, I've just noticed. I, I don't know how I didn't notice this before. But look, there is, from what I can tell, no stone. Which means no furnace. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez, jeez, jeez. Yeah, we're going to have to... Oh, jeez, I nearly walked off the edge there. Wow, okay, never doing that again. I'm going to have to look into that. Um, yeah, I guess that's going to be one of the things we travel further for. I did not go into this expecting it to be like uh, my friend MC's Cobble Haters series, where they never use cobble. Um, yeah, apparently I am now on Cobble Haters Wheel of Misfortune version. Damn, son. That's intense. Anyway, you know what? We're in a good position. I think I'm going to finish this episode off here. That was a really weird noise I just made. Let's never try to recreate that again. So as always, guys, thank you for joining me. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. Also, side note, one of the challenges is indeed to build a house. I am not calling this a house until I have made myself a furnace. So don't think I've forgotten that goal. I haven't. That is just... Yeah, and a bed. So we'll, go, we'll, get, we'll get a bed, we'll get a furnace, place them in this house if we choose to keep this area, and then that'll be it. Anyway, I was continuing on with the outro, wasn't I? Thank you for joining me, guys. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Sorry about the mix-up with 5.0 and 6.0, but we are all fixed now, and I hope you enjoy the series. And I will see you guys next time.